Hello everyone, and welcome to Sheer Stitchery. I'm Katherine Harris, and if you're new here, I do sewing and DIY tutorials each week. So smash that subscribe button down below, and if you like this video, don't forget to give it some love with a like. This week, I wanted to share with you what I like to do with some of my scrap knit fabric, and that is making my own underwear. So I am using Rebecca Page's pattern for the basic panty and the basic thong. So this is an example of the basic thong. And it's really easy to do. It may sound daunting at first to make your own underwear, but mark my word, it is so satisfying to use up those scraps and you can kind of have some matching outfits with your underwear, that's kind of fun as well. And I'll show you some tips and tricks on how to make your underwear just right. So let's get into the tutorial. The gusset. So to start with the panty, we're going to serge the top of our gusset, and then we're going to create a sandwich by laying the back of the panty right on top of that gusset, both of them with right sides pointing up, and then with right sides pointing down, place the front of the panty and stitch along that seam. This will create a sandwich where the gusset is the right side out along the inside of your panty. Now we're going to secure that in place by stitching along the side seams here. And now onto the side seams. So for this, we are going to place our panty right sides together and just stitch down the side seams as you would normally. Now remember to use a stretch stitch on this or a serger to make sure that things stretch. So I'm using a serger on all of my panty here. And you can see it stretches quite nicely. And we're just gonna turn it right side out. And now onto the leg and waistband elastics. So with this, I'm using a Pico elastic. So just check the instructions here on the lengths for the leg and the waist. And then we're going to sew that elastic in a circle. And then we're going to mark in quarters our panty. So where the side seams are uh, is half of the quarter. And then you're going to put it in half again. And then you're going to mark those same areas on your elastic and I like to use a dissolvable water-soluble pen to mark that. And then you're just going to clip it in place along those four areas. And I'm just marking this right here so that I can remember when I'm at the sewing machine because what we're going to do is we're going to stretch it in between, but you don't want to stretch the panty underneath. You just want to stretch the elastic that's along the top, and that'll give you a nice tight finish along the legs and the waistband. And so it comes out looking like this, and now we're going to do the pico. And so then we're going to place that towards the wrong side, and then on the right side, we're just going to zigzag along the top to finish it. And that is what that will look like here with our finished panty. And this exact same instructions for a basic panty as it was for the thong. Just a slightly different pattern. And there you have it. A nice easy way to use up some of those knit scraps to make something quite useful like some panties. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please give it a big like. And if you haven't done so already, please consider subscribing. You can also find me on my socials at Sheer Stitchery on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Until next time, makers, let's get our sewspiration on. Bum, bum, ba, da, ba, da.